What's up my Moon Tribe? I'm Haley, and welcome back to Moon Tribe Tarot. This is going to be for the star sign of Virgo. From August 5th to the 10th of August 2020, take what resonates and leave behind what does not. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me where your messages will 100% correlate to your story because they are for you in mind, you can find all the information on how to reach me in the description box down below. Without any further ado, I have already gone and pulled your cards off camera, like always for you Virgo, so let's get right into it. We got the Nine of Swords, the Knight of Wands, we also got the Three of Cups outcome. So right off the bat, the Knight of Wands, Knight of Swords, Nine of Swords, um, the Knight of Wands indicates somebody that is on his way to doing something. He is a yes man, fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. He comes in strong. He is somebody that has a lot of passion and he is traveling to work um, or play. He is traveling back and forth from home. This could even represent getting a new home, but for the most part, I see this as a spread, as putting in a lot of work Having fears come up in the way and kind of overriding them, I feel like you are somebody that's an overthinker or somebody that you, you have a lot going on. You like to say yes to everything and because of that, it makes it easy for you to kind of push things aside accidentally. In this case, it would be needed for you to put things on the back burner in order to take care of the things in the forefront that you would like to take care of most, while still paying attention to things on the back that could um, maybe don't need as much attention prioritize your focus um it, but it is saying that you have anxiety coming out in the spread and let me have a card for why there's a nine of swords here why is the fear here okay it's directly going to be about a certain person female it could even be yourself but representing that you are afraid of I, I think you are afraid of being rejected by a certain female who would come across as a divine goddess. She is somebody that walks this earth that is definitely not human. You would recognize that she is a divine soul, somebody that just doesn't seem to fit in because she is very high. Um, she is somebody that really understands life and she understands how to flow with it. Gaia, goddess, mother earth, she would be a mother. She would be somebody that is very empathic and knows how to get your creative juices flowing. I think that you might be afraid of not meeting her interest. I think that there are fears when it comes up with this person and specifically, I'm going to ask why are these fears here? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, these are all upside down? Okay. Okay, so why the fears with the Empress? Why the fears with the Empress? Why? Okay, you might have had her in your past before, or you might be healing separately, not from her, from a situation. You have somebody coming in for you, regardless if this is actually this person from the past, or this person coming in is making you afraid. But I think that you are traveling to meet her, I think that you are going on dates with her very enthusiastically, but you are afraid because you have been knocked before. But she is specifically coming in to offer you healing. And to me, uh, I, I feel like you are afraid of trusting again because you are going through a healing process. But where this goes is pretty good for you, Virgo. It represents that there is something coming in for you, either in the realm of friendship or in the, in the realm of love, where something might have happened in the past that really scarred you to relationships before or to trying to get out there, trying to go on dates, trying to whatever this is. Um, even hookups, it doesn't matter. If you were out of the game and you were trying to date now, I think that this person is not going to disappoint you because I do see future success with this person, specifically in the line of sight for parties, getting together, happy occasions, really having your friendship with this person and making the best of it. This could potentially go somewhere for you, if you would like it to, Virgo. This is a very good spread for you. I love you, and I will see you on the flip side. Peace out, my moon tribe. Bye.